Hey guys, what's up? This is Lucifer3717 and today I'm gonna show you how to use XPadder in Windows 7 or you can also use it in Windows XP and Vista. So now let's get started. You just have to do is download XPadder version. You can download it any version. So I have downloaded 5.6. So I have given the link in the description to download it. So and open it you will get these folders so they it contains controller image where you have various controllers choose a controller like this is mine so copy it and paste it on the desktop and open expander So when you minimize it, it goes right here. So click here, new. So this is the this is the place where you win. So now click on open and browse your image. So my one is here double click on it yeah you got it go to sticks so there are various sticks you just have to enable it and do whatever it saying to do so now the left one left up so I have done it. place it here on the left hand lock left right up down see that yes and now Enable the right one. Left up. Place it on the right analog. See that? Now the both analogs are working now. Now go to D pad. Enable it. So D pad is this. Enable it. Up, down, left, right. Now place it on here. They are done. Up, left, right. R up, down, left, right. And now buttons. So you just have to press the buttons like I am pressing X. So here is the button X. Place it on the X. So now then press B. B. This is the button for B. Make sure guys that the button you are pressing is right on the image on the right place. If you if you place the B on A, and when you are playing the game, the controller of B will work as A. So just place place it on the right place. A and now Y. And the L B. You press it right here. And the R here back here and the start here. so next one are for the triggers this one trigger so enable it hold left trigger and hold right trigger so now you are done so just check it once up down left right so you saw that that was very easy now you can do this at home so now press it press ok so press this new yeah now we are done got it so now you can place it your button so like I have placing the A button as enter. So when you press the A button, it will like enter. So, so just look at this. I am pressing the A button. You got that. You can also use this as a mouse. So I will give you an e example. Let's take the left trigger as left button. So these are the mouse buttons. 
the left button the right as the right click so so that i am controlling this with the both the left and the right trigger okay so you saw that and you can place it here as up down left and right so while you're playing game place it as your the game controller so you can place this as s w s a d and this f c r anything so now that's it guys please rate comment and subscribe and if you have any problem please comment bye